Good morning guys, happy Monday. So I'm gonna show you how I'm going to make a, a little egg scramble using some grated zucchini and some shaved Brussels sprouts. So just putting a little bit of zucchini there. And I'm probably gonna have this a couple times this week, so I apologize for repeat of my breakfast, but this is just sounding really good lately. So I've been having it a lot. So I'll just fill a bit in there and then I'm gonna saute that up a little bit and then add in the eggs. I'm also gonna add a little bit of red chili pepper flakes. I love these on pretty much everything, but a little of these go a long way, that's for sure. And then I'm gonna do a little bit of onion salt as well. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put the eggs in there because I don't want the vegetables to cook all the way through. I'm just going to do two full eggs. And just scramble them up. And that is it. I'll show you what it looks like when it's all done. Okay, so my breakfast is all done. So here I have the eggs, zucchini, and Brussels sprouts. I have some avocado here, and then I have some blueberries. So this will be my breakfast. Then I have some coffee here, and I have I still had some of that Cliffia Farms creamer, the almond milk creamer I need to use up, so I have two tablespoons of that in there. So this will be breakfast. Okay, so I just have a snack to show you because lunch today is going to be, um, we're going out as a department at work because we have a new person joining our team, and so we'll be doing that. But I am going to bring a snack for either, probably later in the afternoon because I have a very busy morning at work this week. So, or today, I should say. Um, so anyways, I have a red pepper and then I have some hummus here. So I'm just gonna bring this for something to snack on um, in the afternoon, probably. So tonight's dinner I planned to be really super simple because I knew it was gonna be a busy evening with after school activities. So I picked up a rotisserie chicken. So this is only the chicken breast. And then I also made a side salad with some mixed greens, avocado, tomato, and some onions. And then I'm using the Olive Garden Light dressing. And then I also have a side of green beans. Good morning guys. Um, I'm hoping that's not too loud. So I'm not super hungry this morning, so I'm going to make something and just take it to work because yesterday I was not very hungry at breakfast either, and so I just packaged it up and I found myself to be hungry around 9.30, 9, 9.30, so, um, so anyway, I, what I'm making here is I have one of these turkey, oops, turkey um, polska kielbasa, so that's what I have, and these are the ones that are lower fat, full flavor. So I have one of those there. Here I have a little pile of Brussels sprouts and grated zucchini. So my plan is I'm just going to cook, I cooked this up already, I'm going to cook that up and then I'm going to make kind of a little nest out of it, nest out of it, and then just crack an egg on top and um, steam it a little bit. So, and then, so I'll show you what that looks like in the sun. And then I will put it into a little to-go container and then add a little bit of avocado on top as well. So I'll show you what it looks like when I have it all um, ready to go. Okay, so here's what I was talking about with the egg. So I put the egg on top. I'm going to take this wood, put a little water on the inside of it, and then just put it on top and it'll steam the egg. And this is what it looks like before I put it in my milk prep container. Okay, so here is my breakfast. I did end up putting a little bit of red pepper flakes and onion salt on top. But I feel like when I'm ready to eat, this is going to be a really yummy, yummy breakfast. Okay, so here is my coffee. This is something I am going to drink before I leave for work. So here's my first cup of coffee. And I went back to the fat-free half and half. I just couldn't do the Eclipia Farms anymore. I don't know if it was the pecan caramel flavor. I don't know. But um, I probably will get some nut pods next weekend and do maybe one tablespoon of nut pods and one tablespoon of fat-free half, half and half. I don't know. I just, I like my fat-free half and half, you guys, so that is what I'm going with um, with my coffee today. Okay, so for lunch today, I am bringing one of my enchilada bowls that I made on meal prep. I'll have my meal prep video linked down below so you can see what, how I made this. So basically, there's just some rotisserie chicken with enchilada sauce, green chilies, onions, rice cauliflower. Then I have a bean, rice, and cilantro and onion mixture here. No, bean, not bean, rice, a bean, corn, and cilantro and onion mixture here. 
And for snacks today, I have one of my protein snack boxes. I have a hard boiled egg. I have some of the chili roasted, chili lime roasted almonds, again, that I showed in my meal prep video, a cheese stick, and some turkey lunch meat. This is some peppered turkey lunch meat. And then I do have some hummus and bell peppers also. I don't know if I'll eat all this, but I will let you know what I end up eating. So for dinner on Tuesday night, I made the spinach, chicken, parmesan meatballs that I saw on Shelly's Home Life channel, and I will link her video down below for that. They turned out really, really good. So I had those over zoodles with just some crushed tomatoes. I put um, seasoning in and then a side salad with tomatoes and avocado and red and green onion, and I used some of the Olive Garden light dressing. Good morning guys, so happy Wednesday. I, again, I'm not very hungry this morning, so I'm just put some yogurt in a bowl, I'm just gonna take it to work. So in here I have some plain non-fat Greek yogurt, I just have one serving, and then I put um, some of this coconut extract in there, and I also put a little bit of vanilla extract as well, <clears throat> and then put some blueberries on top, and then some of this raw honey. So that will be my breakfast when I feel like eating it. And I am having a cup of coffee with two tablespoons of fat-free half and half. And for lunch today, I am having some cauliflower and chickpea curry over cauliflower rice. I will have a recipe video for this posted by the time you see this, what I ate this week video, this video would already be posted. So I will have it linked down below and I will try to remember to put a card up above. So this is really super good. Again, it's just over cauliflower rice. I'm not gonna eat this entire portion. This is what I had left, but I promised one of my coworkers who eats a really similar to what I do that I would bring her some. So, but you guys, this is a fantastic recipe. Highly recommend it. So again, go watch that video to see how to make this. And then for snacks today, um, now yesterday I did not eat the lunch meat. I just ate the, actually I didn't eat lunch, lunch meat or the almonds. I was not very hungry. So I had the hard boiled egg and the cheese. Um, so I just brought back the lunch meat and the almonds. So um, but anyway, so here is a snack. And then um, I have my bell pepper and hummus here. So these will be snacks for today. For Wednesday's dinner, I just made a chicken cilantro wonton Asian salad and I used the Newman's own salad dressing for this. So I just used um, the chicken cilantro wontons, some fried wontons, and then just a Asian salad kit. So for breakfast today, I'm gonna again just make breakfast and take it to work because I've been eating around nine o'clock for breakfast and um, eating my lunch like around 1.30. So for some reason, I'm just not as hungry first thing in the morning, but I'm gonna use up the rest of my Brussels sprouts here and zucchini and just saute it in the pan and then just crack two eggs on top and do like a steamed egg. Then I'll just do a side of avocado and also some blueberries. <clears throat> so I'll show you what it looks like when it's all done. Um, but anyway, so I have my zucchini and Brussels sprouts, my two steamed eggs, and then some avocado. So for lunch today, I am taking my last enchilada bowl. So this has cauliflower rice at the bottom. This is just some shredded up rotisserie chicken with some enchilada sauce, some green chilies. And then here I just have a mixture of corn, beans, cilantro, red onion, and green onion. So this will be my lunch today. So for snacks, I am bringing some carrots and hummus. This is just the Hope Original Hummus. And then I broke down my protein boxes because the lunch meat was just a little bit too much this week. I just haven't eaten it. So I've been using it for my son's lunches. So I did recycle it. I didn't just toss it. Um, but I, what I have been eating is my cheese stick, my egg, and then my almonds. So I just made a little bit smaller of a pack for today. So I just wanted to show you guys too. I've been drinking this Teamy Profit all week um, in my Teamy tumbler. Um, the Teamy Profit is supposed to be really good for suppressing your cravings and um, for your immune system and all this other good stuff. So um, anyway, it has, these are the ingredients. So anyway, this is what I've been drinking all week for my tea. So Thursday night dinners are usually just breakfast or leftovers. So tonight I kind of did both. So I took some leftover 
bell pepper that I had chopped up and some onions and I had a few corn tortillas left. So I made the breakfast fajitas that I shared with you guys. So I will link that video down below and here is my dinner.